This is the Lockpicking Lawyer, and what I have for you today is an Anytech brand model L3 fingerprint padlock. I decided to pick one of these up for a couple of reasons. First, I like the design with the fingerprint sensor hidden behind the door. Second, it seems to be more substantial than most comparable products with a 9mm thick shackle. And finally, it advertises IP65 water resistance. Unfortunately, it disappointed on a number of fronts. It turns out this thick shackle is extremely soft. I don't know what metal it's made out of, but it's not magnetic, and one swipe with a mini hacksaw blade cut it very deeply. It's probably zinc or aluminum, and as such, I don't see this offering much in the way of cut resistance. But I'm not sure that matters much, because there's a far easier way to get in. The shackle is held closed with a single spring-loaded locking lug. Now, it's buried too deeply in the lock body to be shimmed, but wrapping on it with a mallet seems to dislodge it quite well. So let's give that a try. I'm going to pull on the shackle and strike it sharply on the side with my urethane mallet. You can see just that quickly we got it open. Let's lock it up and I'll show you it still works. And let's do that one more time so you can see it's not a fluke. Okay, folks, obviously that was a pretty disappointing performance. And given how easy it is to design around this, it's something that I see as inexcusable. In any case, that's all I have for you today. If you do have any questions or comments about this, please put them below. If you like this video and would like to see more like it, please subscribe. And as always, have a nice day. Thank you.